Hey everyone, Chloe here and welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, welcome. So today's video is a PSA for women who have been swindled and conned and brainwashed. And this video is for the women who have contacted me and emailed me asking me how to get the money that they've given to their dusty back. And this video is very important because women being manipulated and conned out of their finances is a low key, high key, uh, silent struggle love epidemic that is pretty common for many, many women because a lot of women are conned and groomed into believing that it is their duty to go over and beyond to help and to assist men and that it is their duty to prove their quote unquote strength and their independence to men and that it is their duty to impress men and to prove to men that they are a valuable asset and many women who are girlfriends and wives and even side chicks are groomed to be, uh, especially particularly uh, black women, are groomed to be surrogate mothers to men. And a lot of black women are groomed to see men as children that cannot survive without their help. And many women uh, lack a profound understanding of what respect is, and what respect means and what respect looks like, right? Through the lens of a man's eyes. You know, a man, ladies, knows that he is supposed to be a provider because this is written and wired into a man's DNA. A man knows that if he wants respect, that he has to have the means to provide and protect. Uh, most men, most men understand that if they are a bum, that their entire existence pretty much makes them a headache because broke men are always begging and broke men are pretty much irritating to be around because broke men and men who are comfortable with being broke expect role reversal and they expect women to be both feminine and masculine. You know, broke men want women to provide for them. So today's PSA is pretty... It's pretty simple. As a standard, ladies, stop giving men money. When a woman gives a man money and handouts and financial support and access to her debit and credit cards and co-signing on loans and allowing men to drive their whips, men do not respect you. And the reason why men do not respect women who give them money is because if you are giving a man money and you are giving him an allowance and you are giving him money so that he won't abandon you, he automatically will put you into the low self-esteem bin and file you into the low self-worth category. Because in his mind, if you are financing him, you are paying him to keep him around. And that is how men think, ladies. You know, they're not thinking that you're nice and that you're kind and that you're loving and that you're the mother that they've never had. They're thinking about your desperation and how much of a sucker you are. Now, are there super rare occasions where a man is in a serious crunch and is desperate and that man has every intention of paying you back with interest? Absolutely. But those occasions are so rare that they aren't even worth mentioning. But most men who are comfortable, and that is the key word here, ladies, comfortable, men who are comfortable asking women for money see you and your low self-esteem coming a mile away. And for men who are opportunists, it is all a game to them. And they know exactly what to say, and they know how to say it, and they know how to lay the pipe, and they know how to hustle you because women are easily impressed by the one-two sucker punch of attention and flattery. And flattery and unearned praise is another reason why this video was so necessary to be made because women are so easily impressed and duped by compliments and women get caught up and hung up on being verbally flattered by men and women often see flattery as validation because women in their desperation can be pretty uh, love starved and hungry for affection and attention and in many ways uh, women are like flowers without attention they wither and this is why working on your self-esteem is so important because without doing the work of self-esteem a woman will always get got and without self-worth a woman will think and believe that it is her job to flatter and impress men and that it is her job to prove that she is an asset to men instead of understanding that the sperm always chases the egg and that the woman is forever the prize no matter what the keyboard gangsters say and a lot of women will get triggered by what i'm about to say but as many uh many women i need to say this many women are easily duped and conned by unearned praise and unearned means you didn't earn it and unearned praise is a strategy 
that con men use to flatter women who invest nothing in their appearance and their looks. This is dusty strategy one-on-one, where a, a woman either looks homely or she looks a hot mess or she looks busted and disgusted on the daily or she brags about being a plain Jane and not needing makeup. Uh, these are the women who tend to get conned the most because they are flattered that men are giving them compliments and attention without them ever having to gussy themselves up. This is unearned praise 101, telling a woman what she wants to hear, uh, not only to disarm her, but to stroke her ego and her unearned vanity to make her feel like investing in herself is something that is only uh, reserved for shallow, weave-wearing uh, gold diggers. And dusty con men are really good at gassing the ego of a plain Jane because a plain Jane wants to be noticed without ever having to put in the work or the effort. So ladies, stop supporting your dusty's weed habit Stop helping him pay his child support. Stop supporting his SoundCloud mixtape volumes one through 70. Stop buying him J's and kicks and stop taking him shopping because the money that you spend on him is money that you will never ever get back. So if you've given a man your money, ladies, cut your losses and learn the lesson because I will always say this on my channel, men do not need our help. Men need our feminine inspiration to become their best masculine selves which is why you need to subscribe to this channel and men by nature resent women who help them because women who help men are usually trying to buy love and loyalty and reciprocity and attention and those are simply things that money cannot buy and women who give money to men are usually giving it under the condition and the pretense of tightly controlled puppet strings but it always backfires because men do not like being controlled by women and men do not feel guilty when women lack standards. Men laugh at and clown women who allow themselves to be used and men laugh at women who allow men to con them. So as a solution, ladies, invest in yourself, learn how to become hypergamous or at the very least, become a more self-invested feminine version of yourself. Stop financing the D, stop looking haggard and homely, and you will stop attracting men who only care about your gross income after taxes. So stay tuned for more videos to come, and I will catch up with you guys in the next one.